I should be processing all the participants that I see every day. Uh, it's not being possible due to the caseload right now. Um, even though it went a little bit down because I used to have 4,000 cases a couple of weeks ago, and right now I'm close to 3,000. Um, basically, it is impossible, humanly impossible, to complete a task. As a single worker, I'm interviewing 15 families a day, right? So I don't, I don't have, I, there is no way I can recopulate all the information from one family in 15 minutes because every family is having emergencies now. Every single case is complicated. Every single case is at the edge, at the end of the rope. Why? Because we have been like this almost two years. Every single case is an emergency. But the waiting time is horrific. Uh, they would wait two hours, three hours, just to be seen, uh, or just to have their initial application processed. It's just downright frustrating when you have your hand, you can, you have that power, but you can't follow through because there's so many people there and you can only do so much, only do so much. And um, I feel sorry for these people because they're, they're coming here with their hands open and say, help me. And we can't, we just have to look at them and say, I'm sorry. We can't help you. We can only serve our participants so much to the best that we can. Uh, I don't think that they really realize the pressure that we're under. We try to do the best we can. I do see my coworkers, you know, they got their moments of stress. Um, people, you know, getting sick, not coming to work. There is no way that I, one human being, can serve 4,000 families. There is no way. You may go around mathematically, you go around day and night, and you will not find the right solution because humanly it is impossible. Put money into the program. Not just put the money, but direct the money into the right programs, 